The far future, here defined as the time beyond the 10th millennium, has been used as a setting in many works of fiction or popular scientific speculation. Doctor Who The British science fiction series Doctor Who has featured many events beyond the 10th millennium AD due to time travel being a key aspect of its format. 12,005 AD, according to the episode The End of the World, a new Roman Empire has been established on Earth by this year. 17,100 AD, the Doctor and Amy Pond visit the Delirium Archive, and receive a message from River Song, the Time of Angels. 37,166 AD, Planet of Evil, a geological survey is almost annihilated by anti-matter creatures. 200,000 AD, Events of the Long Game. The mighty Jagrafess is revealed to have usurped the fourth great and bountiful human empire. 200,100 AD, Events of Bad Wolf and the Parting of the Ways. Earth culture is dominated by lethal game shows and reality television transmitted from a giant space station. The Jagrafess is revealed to have been a pawn of the Daleks, who attempt an invasion of Earth after the Dalek Emperor recreates the race following the events of the Last Great Time War. 500,000 AD, humanity on Earth have evolved into hemivores. The last creature alive in the polluted world is Ingiger, the Ancient One, who was brought to the 10th century by the power of Fenric. 2 million AD, the mysterious planet, Earth is devastated after being moved by the Time Lords and renamed Ravelox. At some unknown point thereafter, Earth is returned to its original position. 4 million AD, the Usurians exploit and ruthlessly tax humans on Pluto. 10 million AD, in the Ark, a group of humans and monoids make a 700-year star voyage from Earth, which is about to crash into the Sun. 5 billion AD, the end of the world. The date is given by the locals as 5.5, Apple, 26 The episode establishes the destruction of the original planet Earth at this time, caused by the expansion of its Sun. 5 billion 12 AD, twice upon a time, establishes that the Testimony Foundation is designed to save people from death. The Foundation would take people near death and implant their memories into glass bodies, allowing them to live as glass persons founded on New Earth. 5 billion 23 AD, in the episode New Earth, humans are shown to have moved to a new planet and called it New Earth in the galaxy M87. 5 billion 53 AD, events of gridlock. Inhabitants of New New York released from quarantine. The face of Bo, later hinted in Last of the Time Lords to possibly be a future version of Jack Harkness, one of the oldest creatures in the universe, apparently dies. After c. 1 trillion AD, Hellbent establishes that the Doctor's home planet, Gallifrey, has been hiding at the end of time. Later in the episode, the Doctor and his companion, Clara Oswald, travel even further, to when Gallifrey is the last planet orbiting the last star. 100 trillion AD, Utopia, the last remnants of humanity who have mostly evolved back into today's familiar form seek out a legendary Utopia in this year, aided by a Time Lord with suppressed memories, revealed to be the Master. After c. 100 trillion AD, listen, due to a malfunction involving an experimental time ship, chrononaut Orson Pink finds himself trapped at the end of the universe, though he is later rescued by the Doctor and returned to his proper time. Topic. Dune Frank Herbert's Dune series spans thousands of years of distant future history in a galactic, and eventually multigalactic, setting, describing an interstellar feudal system enabled by a prescience imbuing drug known as the Spice. C. 11713-12397 AD, Rise of the Thinking Machines and Their Enslavement of Humanity C. 12,799-912 AD, Butlerian Jihad ends the rule of the thinking machines c. 13,000 AD, 1 AG after Guild, the Spacing Guild founded c. 23,190-193 AD, 10,190-193 AD, 10,190 AD, Events of Dune the Galactic Emperor Shaddam IV leads Duke Leto I Atreides into a trap by handing him Arrakis, the only known source of the spice, only to have him killed by Vladimir Harkonnen. Leto's son Paul Atreides escapes and overthrows the Emperor c. 
23206-207 AD, events in Dune Messiah. Paul concludes a jihad to unify the empire under his rule. Conspiracy against Paul fails, but leaves him blind. His children Leto and Ghanima are born. C. 23216-217 AD, events of Children of Dune. Paul Atreides dies, his son Leto II merges with a sandworm, allowing him to rule for thousands of years. The Golden Path is established. C. 26725 AD, events of God Emperor of Dune. Leto II is killed. C. 28229-230 AD, events of Heretics of Dune. The Honored Matres destroy Arrakis. C. 28240 AD, events of Chapterhouse Dune. A new Dune is being created on the Chapterhouse planet. C. 28241-259 AD, events of Hunters of Dune. The thinking machines are shown to control threads of evolution, space and time. C. 28260-267 AD, events of Sandworms of Dune. Day of Kralizek ends with the defeat of the thinking machines and humanities move beyond prescient detection. <laughs> Foundation series Isaac Asimov's Foundation series, comprising the union of his robot novels, Galactic Empire novels and Foundation novels, describes a future history of humanity from 1996 to tens of thousands of years from now. The 11th millennium occurs after the end of the robot stories. 11,300 AD, events of the stars, like dust. The planet Rhodia rebels against a local tyranny and rediscovers the U.S. Constitution, leading to a brief experiment with democracy. 12,000 AD, events of the currents of space. Trantor expands its territory. Knowledge that Earth is the human birthworld is slowly fading. 12,500 AD 1 GE, the Galactic Empire is founded with Trantor as its capital. 13,327 AD, events of pebble in the sky. A shunned Earth rediscovers its heritage. 24,520, AD, events of prelude to foundation. Hari Seldon begins his attempts to make psychohistory practical in order to stave off the imminent collapse of the empire. 24,528-569 AD, events of forward the foundation. Hari Seldon, his family gradually dying around him, begins to formulate the Seldon plan and found the foundation and second foundation. 24,567 AD 12,067 GE, 1 FE, Hari Seldon put on trial. Foundation exiled to Terminus. 24,569-762 AD, events of Foundation. Anacreon declares independence. The Foundation's homeworld of Terminus is cut off from the Empire. Over time, it begins to exert religious and then economic influence over its surrounding region. 24,762-867 AD, events of Foundation and Empire. Trantor is sacked. The Foundation is attacked first by the Remnant Empire and then by the Mule, a powerful psychic, who succeeds in conquering it, overthrowing the remains of the Empire and establishing his own. 24,867-943 AD, events of Second Foundation. The Second Foundation defeats the Mule and then eludes the First Foundation's attempt to conquer it. 25,065 AD, events of Foundation's Edge. Golan Trevise attempts to locate the legendary Earth, only to discover Gaia, a previously unknown power in the galaxy, who offer an alternative to the Selden plan or a new empire, Galaxia, a galaxy in which all life and nonlife is unified in a single intelligence. 25,066 AD, events of Foundation and Earth. Golan Trevise locates Earth, now radioactive and uninhabitable, but ultimately locates Daniil Olivao, a 20,000-year-old robot who has been secretly guiding humanity's evolution from a base on the Moon. 12,700,000 to 15 million AD, humanity has completely died out according to an alternate future described in the end of eternity. This future was supposedly avoided by ensuring that humanity gained access to intergalactic travel. 
The book's connection to the Foundation series is contested, but several links have been established. The Future is Wild The Future is Wild was a speculative documentary hypothesizing how life could evolve over the course of millions of years. 5 million, the world is in an ice age. The Mediterranean Sea will be a vast salt plain and the Amazon rainforest will be a grassland. Creatures of this land include huge killer birds, thin-legged pigs, sticky frilled lizards and birds that act like whales. Humans, by this time, have either gone extinct or have left the planet. 100 million, in 100 million years time, the world will be very hot due to excess volcanic activity. Antarctica will be a lush rainforest. Creatures of this world include dinosaur-sized tortoises, amphibious octopuses, four-winged birds and eusocial spiders. At this time, there is also only one species of mammal left, which is farmed by the spiders. 200 million, in 200 million years time the world will contain one global ocean and one continent, like Pangaea. Approximately 100 million years before this time, there was a mass extinction and now most of the world's land is desert, with a couple of rainforests around the edge. Creatures of this world include air-breathing flying fish, giant plankton, various huge worms, highly specialized insects and intelligent, arboreal land squid. There are no mammals, no birds, no reptiles, no amphibians, only one species of flowering plants and only sharks left to represent aquatic fish. Other creatures have moved in to fill these niches. Topic: <laughs> Last and First Men and Star Maker. Olaf Stapledon's novels Last and First Men and Star Maker are speculations on the evolution of intelligence in the universe. Last and First Men explores the future evolution of intelligence on Earth, while Star Maker explores the technological and social changes undergone by various alien species. Topic: <laughs> Last and First Men. 100,000 AD, rise and fall of the Patagonians, the first men enter in eclipse. About 10 million AD, rise of the second men, the Martian wars and the ruin of two worlds. 120 million AD, third men in the wilderness, rise of fourth men. 400 million AD, the moon crashes into Earth, the fifth men migrate to Venus. 1 billion AD, the sun begins to expand into a red giant, migration of the ninth men to Neptune. 2 billion AD, end of man, the 18th men. 5 billion AD, the sun dies. Topic: <laughs> Star Maker. 20 billion AD, the War of Worlds occurs. 30 billion AD, the Second Galactic Utopia occurs. 40 billion AD, the first colonization of dead stars occurs. 50 billion AD, the supreme moment of the cosmos occurs. 500 billion AD, complete physical quiescence of the universe. The last question Isaac Asimov's short story The Last Question charts the future evolution of man as subsequent generations ask ever more complex computers the same question. Can entropy be reversed? The story begins in 2061, when the supercomputer Multivac is asked the question and responds, Insufficient data for meaningful answer. The story then jumps forward to an unspecified time at least a thousand years later, in which a spaceship born computer is asked the same question and gives the same answer. CA, 22,000, humans, now immortal, are filling up the Milky Way galaxy and are considering expanding beyond it. The Galactic AC is asked the question and replies, There is insufficient data for a meaningful answer. CA, 10 billion, mankind now sleeps in hibernation as minds travel the universe. The hyperspatial computer the Universal AC is asked the question and replies, There is as yet insufficient data for a meaningful answer. CA, 100 billion, man, now a single cosmic intelligence, realizes that the stars are winding down. The cosmic AC is asked the question and responds, There is as yet insufficient data for a meaningful answer. 
CA, 10 trillion, man fuses with the AC and entropy destroys the universe. Some unspecified amount of time later, the AC, from its home in hyperspace, formulates its answer to the question and demonstrates it with the exclamation, Let there be light. The late Philip J. Fry The Futurama episode The Late Philip J. Fry concerns a journey into the far future 10,000 AD, post-apocalyptic future in which first the humans, then the apes, then the birds, then the cows and then the ambiguous slug-like creatures each created and destroyed their respective civilizations. 105,105 AD, Snowball Earth in which Eskimos ride walruses. 252,525 AD, medieval world in which knights ride ostriches. 351,120 AD, ocean planet in which giant carnivorous shrimp use merman-like lures to catch prey. 1,000,000.5 AD, another medieval world in which mankind has been enslaved by giraffes. 5 million AD, humanity has diverged into two separate species, hyper-advanced elfin humanoids and the brutish dumlocks. 5 million 5 AD, time by which the dumlocks have destroyed the elfin humanoids' civilization. 10 million AD, Terminator-esque future in which humanity has been enslaved by killer machines. 50 million AD, advanced civilization composed primarily of scantily clad buxom women. 1 billion AD, all life is extinct on Earth. 1040 AD, the universe ends. Some point later, a second universe begins. 10,000 AD again, post-apocalyptic future in which first the humans, then the apes, then the birds, then the cows and then the ambiguous slug-like creatures each created and destroyed their respective civilizations. 1040 AD again, the second universe ends. Some point later, a third universe begins. 3010 AD After two complete cycles of the entire universe, the same exact universe, except 10 feet higher. <laughs> Star Trek The science fiction franchise Star Trek has made several allusions to far future events. 12,200 AD, radiation levels in the Andromeda galaxy are expected to reach intolerably high levels, according to scientists of the Kelvin Empire. 50,000 AD, the androids of planet Mud will cease to function. 2 million AD, Nella Darren's projected star model is either proven or disproven. 60-70 trillion AD, if the genetically engineered human Jack's prediction was correct, the universe will collapse. The Time Machine H. G. Wells's novel The Time Machine concerns an anonymous time traveler who embarks on a journey to Earth's far future 802,701, most events in the novel occur in this year. The time traveler discovers a land in which the idyllic humanoid Eli have been reduced to the level of cattle for the cannibalistic Morlocks, who reside underground and tend their flock. Above with vast machines. Approximately 30 million, the time traveler arrives at a twillet, desolate beach. The only inhabitants he sees are large, moth-like creatures and giant, threatening crabs. C. Beyond 30 million, the beach is now flecked with ice and snow, the only observed life is a football-sized tentacled creature. In the more distant future, the sun turns red and the planet is left moonless. The Earth becomes a cold wasteland where all life except for green slime has died out. Topic: <laughs> Warhammer 40,000. The Games Workshop created wargaming franchise Warhammer 40,000 as as its title suggests, set around the 40th millennium of its fictional universe. Greater than 14,000 AD, Age of Terra. Mankind is confined to the solar system. The future emperor of mankind secretly guides humanity's evolution. 14,000–25,000 AD, Dark Age of Technology. Mankind develops warp travel and reaches out to other star systems, in the process attaining its highest level of technical sophistication. 25,000–30,000 AD, Age of Strife. 
The rise of psychers and the influence of the Chaos Gods sends the human race into a period of anarchy. Persistent warp storms cut off many human worlds from the rest of the galaxy. Early 30th millennium AD, the fall of the Eldar occurs. Slaanesh, a god of chaos, is born. The event calms the warp storms, allowing humanity to advance across the galaxy again. 30,000 AD, Age of the Imperium begins. Emperor of Mankind, after unifying Shattered Terra, launches a great crusade to reclaim the human planets under his rule and locate the twenty primarchs scattered across the galaxy by the forces of chaos. C. 30,004 AD, the Horus Heresy begins. The Emperor, after defeating Horus, is placed near death on the Golden Throne. 35,000, Age of Apostasy. The Imperium falls temporarily under the tyrannical rule of Goj Vandire. C. 4000-41000 AD, real time of the Warhammer 40,000 universe, it is the temporal setting for most of the related backstories, novels, video games and other spin-offs released as of January 2013. ZLE sequence Stephen Baxter's Zeely Sequence, a collection of novels and short stories describing mankind's war with a superintelligent race called the Zeely, spans a time period from the Big Bang to billions of years in the future. 10102 AD, Events of Lakes of Light 10515 AD, Events of the Godal Sunflowers 10537 AD, Events of Breeding Ground 12478 AD Events of the Dreaming Mold 12659 AD Events of the Great Game War with the Zeli begins 20424 AD Events of the Chop Line 21124 AD Events of Vacuum Diagrams 22254 AD Events of In the Unblack 23,479 AD, Events of Riding the Rock 24,973 AD, Events of Exultant. Conquest of the Galactic Center by the Human Race. 24,974 AD, Events of Mayflower II 27,152 AD, Events of Between Worlds c. 40,000 AD, The Bifurcation of Mankind Occurs C. 90,000 AD, Reunification 104,858 AD, Events of Raft and Stowaway 168,349 AD, Launch of the Exaltation of the Integrality 171,257 AD, Events of the Tyranny of Heaven 193,474 AD, Events of Hero 193,700 AD, Events of Flux 200,000 AD, Establishment of the Commonwealth c. 500,000 AD, Events of Transcendent c. 500,000 AD, Mankind Begins Its Retreat c. 1 million AD, Events of the Siege of Earth. Humanity is defeated and imprisoned c. 1 to 4 million years from now, Zeli and Futino birds alter physical universe. c. 4 million years from now, migration of Zeli through the ring. Sun leaves the main sequence. Events of secret history 4,101,214 AD, events of Shell 4,101,266 AD, events of the Eighth Room 4,101,284 AD, events of the Baryonic Lords 4,900,000 years from now, final destruction of the Ring by Futino birds begins. 5 million years from now, events of Ring 10 million years from now, virtual extinction of Baryonic life. Most of the last humans survive on a time-shifted Earth. 3,800,000,000 years from now, Periandry's quest 4 billion years from now, climbing the blue 4 billion 500 million years from now, events of the time pit 4 billion 800 million years from now, events of the lowland expedition 5 billion years from now, events of formidable caress. Milky Way Andromeda Collision
1 trillion 500 billion years from now, stars evaporate from galaxies. Other fiction Literature 11,989–12,004, The Events of the Septimus Heap series by Angie Sage take place. c. 16,000, Cordwainer Smith's novel Norstralia is set in the 160th century, amidst the rediscovery of man, an effort by the instrumentality of mankind to inject new life to humanity's stagnant utopia via the reinstatement of old customs. Smith's instrumentality future history spans the millennia from the 21st to the 160th centuries 2001, the events of the epilogue to 2010, Odyssey 2 occur. 25,000, events of James Blish's novel Midsummer Century 345th century, the setting of most of the stainless steel rat novels. 100,000, Gregory Benford's Great Sky River is set around this year. 1,001,986 1 million years later from 1986, when the events of Kurt Vonnegut's Galapagos have taken place and humanity has evolved to seal like creatures with limited thinking. 4 million, Larry Niven's novel A World Out of Time is partially set around this time. 5 million, in Man After Man, an anthropology of the future, the last descendants of humanity are destroyed and the surface of Earth is rendered uninhabitable. 6,200,000, the events of Alistair Reynolds' novel House of Sons take place around this time. 7 million, in John W. Campbell's short story Twilight 1934, a man of the fourth millennium witnesses the decline of a dull human race, which has colonized the solar system and made machines supply all its needs. C.A. 8 million, in the works of Clark Ashton Smith, The Time of Zothique, Last Continent of Earth, and Home to the Dying Remnants of the Human Race. The culture is on a barbaric level, and magic has become dominant over science. Ten million, according to Kurt Vonnegut's The Sirens of Titan, all human history between AD 1 and AD 1 million will be forgotten this year. Eighteen million, a half-plastic denizen of the interior of a planet beyond Pluto is among those that exchanges mind with the great race of Yeath in H.P. Lovecraft's The Shadow Out of Time. 18,906,416, the starting year on Civilization 647, chanced upon by the last two surviving Earth humans after escaping a space rift, nearing the end of Death's End. 20 million, the approximate date when the night land is set. 50 million, the book after man, a zoology of the future takes place at this time. 500 million, in Stephen Baxter's novel Evolution, last descendants of man live in a symbiotic relation with Boromets like trees on the red, Mars-like plains of Pangaea Ultima. 1 billion, human extinction occurs across the galaxy Brian Aldous, galaxies like grains of sand. 1 billion 560 million, the fictional extraterrestrial author in Nemo Ramjet's All Tomorrow's Lives and publishes its eponymous work about the long extinct descendants of humanity by this time. 10 billion, Arthur C. Clarke's novel, Against the Fall of Night 20 billion, Jack Vance, The Dying Earth 170 quintillion years after the Big Bang, the universe ends with a big crunch in Douglas Adams' The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. 500 quintillion, in Stephen Baxter's Manifold, Time Novel, The Last Descendants of Humanity, close to the Big Freeze, make some changes to our near present in order to release the universe's vacuum energy, spawn new universes, and prevent the Big Freeze from happening at this time. 10 duodecillion, 1040, in Frederick Pohl's novel The World at the End of Time in a dark, frigid, and huge universe where protons are decaying only a handful of stars conserved by relativistic time dilation remain in the planetary system, on one of them living the last humans. Topic film and television 10535, the Don Hertzfeldt directed couch gag from the Simpsons episode Clown in the Dumps features Homer time traveling his TV forward to that year to watch the Simpsons episode number 164775.7 12004 12004-12006, the events of Eureka 7, 14292, on the distant finale of Aim for the Top. 
Gunbuster, Mecha pilots Noriko Takaya and Kazumi Amano arrive on Earth 12,000 years ahead of their time, having entered on a black hole in the early 21th century and experienced the effects of extreme time dilation. The story of Diebuster, its sequel, takes place ten years prior to EOG and ends with the same event, this time seen from Earth's perspective. 40,000, the film Barbarella takes place in this year ca. 50,000, in the Stargate Atlantis episode, The Last Man, by this time Lantia's son has turned into a red giant, rendering the planet uninhabitable. 207, 012, pronounced 2070 in the Gravity Falls episodes, The Time Traveler's Pig, and, Blendon's Game, the year that time traveler Blendon Blenjamin Blandin is from. CA, 1 million, in the Babylon 5 episode The Deconstruction of Falling Stars, approximately 1 million years after the founding of the Interstellar Alliance 2262 AD, humans evolve into beings of energy. They leave Earth for the old Vorlan homeworld, and ultimately destroy the solar system to keep any remaining technology out of the hands of younger races. Approximately 2 million, the Ralph Bakshi film Wizards is set in this year. Approximately 3,002,100, most of the events of the sci-fi sitcom Red Dwarf occur around this time the premise of the show is set 3 million years into the future after protagonist Dave Lister, who is from the 22nd century, is put into suspended animation for that many years, approximately 41,740,659 AD, Guardians Evolution takes place, 100 million, the Cartoon Network series Time Squad takes place during this year where there are no more more wars, no more pollution, and bacon's good for your heart. Also, all the nations have formed into one supercontinent. 400 billion, Ren and Stimpy's space adventures as Commander Hook and Cadet Stimpy take place in this year. Games 11,344, Events of Planetfall 11,945, Events of Nier, Automata 13,271, Events of Creeper World Approximately 14,000, the Splatoon games take place at least 12,000 years after humanity's extinction, which is implied to be in the near future. 17,276-17,278, the events of the game Xenogears begin. 23,341, the current date in the MMORPG EVE Online. 189,346, current date in the Noctis Universe. 1 billion, approximate date of the Numenera setting as it is stated the Ninth World takes place 1 billion year in the future, after eight previous civilizations. 281,474,976,712,644, setting of the cancelled game 0x10c. Unknown date possibly very far into the future, setting of the Warframe universe. Comics 10,000-15,000 10,000-15,000, Micronauts, by this time, humanity has evolved into a variety of subspecies. Several of these species flee across time and space to escape a genocidal war. 14,017, the current year of the Archie Comics series of Sonic the Hedgehog. 85,270, many of the events of the DC Comics DC 1 million series. Superman emerges from his 15,000-year exile in his fortress of solitude inside the sun. 100,000, the Superman of the future, seen in Action Comics No. 256 claims to come from this year. 4 million Captain Marvel Jr. No. 99 shows that by this period the Earth is inhabited by little green men. 5 million, the Futurians, the time era where the Inheritors lived before their attempted conquest ruined their Earth and they traveled back to the late 20th century to try to conquer a younger Earth. Other 12,570, date of the Orion's Arm World Building Project Topic. See also Apocalyptic and post-apocalyptic fiction Dying Earth subgenre.